All About Injuries is our topic tonight on Law Call. I'm Morgan Dukes, and our next question comes to us from Kyle, and he has a car accident question. And his question says, my friend's brother was in an accident where the car rolled over several times, but the airbags never deployed. He was seriously injured. The question is, can they sue the manufacturer? Is that a possibility? I'm yes. going to let Rocky actually answer that one. I believe Rocky's been involved with some airbag cases. So, Rocky, what do you say? Yeah, our, our firm certainly handled quite a few uh, uh, airbag cases here at Morgan & Morgan. And, and what you have is a products liability case, Morgan. And that can be mm -hmm. from a defective warning or from a defective design in a product or even from a manufacturing defect. But the most common uh, for, for those type of cases is probably a warning or a design defect because these are life safety devices like a seatbelt, and they're supposed to protect you in a wreck. What they're not supposed to do is make it worse. And what I've seen is cases where someone was driving, gets in a wreck, and then a safety device like an airbag breaks their neck or causes permanent injury to their uh, face or scars or burns even from the airbag. It is not supposed to do that. And if you have one of those cases uh, yeah, you, you may have a product's liability case, but the most important thing in a product's case is securing the evidence. If you don't uh, call order immediately so they can send out letters, preserve the evidence, find the vehicle, get the airbag, and not tamper with the evidence, you don't want to do that either. You want to notify all the parties first. You got to do that. Patrick, spoliation or pulling the evidence can be a big deal. You want to talk about that real quick? Absolutely, Rocky, and I 100 percent agree. In fact, I was going to follow up on that very point. I'm always amazed at what an expert can determine from an accident by looking at the evidence that, that a layperson or even a lawyer doesn't fully understand. And so it's important to know two things about this. Number one, there are specific experts designed in airbag, airbag deployment cases, and they know exactly what to look for. Number two, there are things in the vehicle that you and I are not aware of, data that is recorded, that an expert like that can come in and make determinations about the functionality of that airbag that we don't know about. And so it's very important that while we, uh, we may know where the car is, we need to make sure that car is secure. We may need to make sure no one's around it. And we need to make sure that you get a, a attorney who can go get an expert, get them retained quickly. Someone like Rocky gets an expert in there very quickly to make sure they can get all the most pertinent data they can before someone messes with that vehicle. 